Okay. Let's figure it out. Gun here. Just watching Jeopardy. Under five people in Jeopardy. Japanese Jeopardy. <laughs> Does appear to be some kind of game show. <laughs> Biker gangs. <laughs> Biker gangs. <laughs> she doesn't know what either of them mean. They sound cool together. Yeah. Someone, might, something might appear on the midnight channel. Watch TV in our room. Don't really have any other options, I guess. Another, another people had uh, exclamations over their head. It's raining. All right. Let's see what we got here. Oh no! Let's that shirt! That's confirming our suspicions. But he doesn't have tits for eyes, I'm confused. Clearly a different person. Ah, uh, couldn't be him. Oh man. That makes me not have shoes. Did you see that? I did. It might be that guy. Definitely, Kanji. Yeah, I think so too. Well, that was who we saw on the TV. I mean, Dojima said that. I knew I saw him somewhere. He was on TV. He was on that special news report. He punched a camera guy. He's one scary dude. He was even yelling at the camera to get bent. <laughs> one scary right. dude. So we finally have a lead. Let's all get together tomorrow, okay? Go talk to scary dudes. Oh, I almost forgot. It's kind of off subject, but as long as you're on the line. Mind if I ask something? Um... Maybe... This depends. How off subject? It's something I've been meaning to ask for a while. Oh, crap. Um... This doesn't sound so, good. What do you think about Yukiko and Chie? I mean, well, let's not mince words. Which one's your type? Um... Very interesting question. Uh... All of the well, ladies... Well, we, we like both of them. We haven't decided yet. Oh, uh, no, no. There's no decision. We like all of the ladies. Okay, well, there is actually a mechanical difference between the options. We're going to take both because it gives us understanding points. Neither gives us courage points. Um, and the two options on the road reason. don't seem to give us anything. Yeah, these ones don't do anything. It just gives you different responses. But we're going to pick both because that's the points. So I think we don't really need any of them. We don't really need either of those right now. Because I think we're at we're at three for courage, so we'll take the understanding, I guess. Both ladies. All the ladies. Every ladies, except for ladies that are too... We worded it more diplomatically, though. Yeah. No, that's what we said. Oh, wait, we have eloquence. Yeah, I guess we did word it diplomatically. Fuck. <laughs> Seriously? Well, you get a better chance that way. I just spray it everywhere and hope it sticks. I mean, <laughs> I meant my 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 hey, my preferences. Hey, hey, hey! You are eloquent now. You can't yeah. say things like that. You're to say things that mean that, but don't directly say it. Yes. <laughs> okay, see you tomorrow. I forgot. I forgot. Eloquent now. Damn it! It's ruining everything. Ugh. Fucking Yusuke. The one who was on last night. It's that guy, right? Kanji Tatsumi, huh? He definitely didn't look like the social type. Now there's an understatement. Isn't he really scary? Uh, did you see the news special the other day? I don't know why Chie is scared of him. Yeah, yeah I saw it. Scared. Well, she's scared of grasshoppers. Yeah. Maybe she thinks you she's a dog. On biker gangs? I watched it too. Yukiko was into biker gangs. He wasn't <laughs> like that when he was younger, though. Oh, she knows him. You know him, Yukiko? Uh huh. But we haven't talked to each other in a long time. Biker gangs and all that. His family runs a textile shop, and we've been a customer of theirs for many years. That makes sense. So I speak with kanji -kun's mother from time to time. Like curtains and kimonos and stuff, I guess. Oh, why don't we go there now? We might be able to talk to him in person. Hey, were you on the TV t twice? Sounds good. At the very least, we can ask if so anything strange answer would be yes, he has been on the TV. What? You saw that? Good friend! Interviewed him. <laughs> I wouldn't want to run into him in a dark alley, but... 
pretty sure he won't fly off the handle in his family store. Punch your camera. <laughs> All right, then let's get going. If Every things get rough, we're like counting that, on you guys. He is a high school freshman. <laughs> it's just really funny. I like how Chie is, is counting on us for protection here. <laughs> Chie is the most physical combat leading character in our party at the moment. And yet she's afraid of biker gang dudes. Well, she doesn't want to wear herself out. True, she needs training. Hello. Ah, Yuki-chan. It's so nice to see you. Well then, if you'll excuse me, ma'am. Uh-huh, yep. Everything, okay, slender young man. everything on the screen is believable. I'm sorry that I couldn't help more. Hey, Chie. It's all right. You've given me plenty to think about. There's Thank one you. of those dividers. Go kick a hole in it. <laughs> <laughs> Later, slender guy. He's What's up with him? Obviously not slender. Weirdo. Slender man. <laughs> completely <laughs> different. It's not white. His face is not white. He is but a boy. <laughs> he is not yet a man. He hasn't grown his tentacles Never yet. Seen him before. <laughs> Nor his unnatural colors. Yuki chan, you're as lovely as always. It's less creepy when the shop owner says it than mm. when pretty much everyone else in the game says it. <laughs> pretty much everyone. Your features are starting to remind me of your mother when she was young. How can I help you today? Are you out shopping with your friends? Oh, um, actually. well, actually. We're buying swatches for our secret clubhouse. We need curtains. Surround her. Or it's curtains Don't for you. <laughs> hey, this scarf? I've seen this somewhere before. Why is it mystery music with the scarf? Yeah, the a scarf is an important clue. Scarf. Huh? Oh, you're right. Where was that? Where was that, viewers? <gasps> it was that place. Inside the TV. Yes. Inside the TV. <laughs> things you, things to say in front of shopkeepers. Excellent work, GA. That's right. That room with those faceless posters. Exactly. Then it's that announcer. Two. Hmm. It was the one that was shaped Are into you a noose. Are the of Miss Yamano? Uh, well, kinda. I mean, we're investigating her murder, or something. Um. Did Miss Yamano happen to have a scarf like this? Yes. It was a special order she placed. Well, this does attach this to the rest of the case. It does. It does. She, she actually pattern. ordered a pair, but in the end, she said she only wanted the women's scarf. Oh, mm. no. It left us with no choice but to sell this one separately. Nobody wants it because of the scandal. Oh man, there is a connection to the first case. What are we gonna do? This old lady doesn't care. How should I know? He's just here to sell fabric. True. Hello? Delivery here for the Tatsumis. So you got a doorbell, but you got one of those slidey paper doors. Hey, that's in the back. That's kind of normal. Okay. Oh, I'll be right there. I'm sorry. You'll Seems have like to excuse me. Odd. Oh, it's okay. just there we so you can, like, open the room up. Or close it up and make it smaller or bigger as you need. It just, look, it just looks like the door to me. I don't know. It's more of like a sliding wall. Is that so? Well, then please say hello to your mother for me. It really is connected to the first case after all. But it's just a scarf. Would the killer target someone just because of that? Yes. Damn it, what's going on? Scarf murder. Come on, let's talk outside. Hmm? It's Kanjikun. Run! Well, quick, hide! Oh, <laughs> Yusuke did have that idea. Let's hide in plain sight. Not fooling anyone, you know. 
<laughs> Very I well. I can't hear what they're yes. saying. Uh oh. T tomorrow's fine with me. Uh, okay. Huh? S school. Of course I'm going to school. This, viewers, is what a badass biker gang member sounds like. Look at him. Look at him, he's got a scar. He doesn't have, like, a band-aid on his head. He's got a scar. Probably got, like, shot in the head or something. Yeah. With Middle that school. bullet! That bullet that yeah. pierced his temple. It was stopped by his... And then he went out and he grabbed the casing and put the bullet back in it. And then made a necklace with it. And he went home and he studied for his exam. And he did okay. Not particularly good. Not particularly bad. Of course he's going to school. Did he, did he say he was interested? Whoa. <laughs> he's a guy. And I'm, and I'm a, guy. a guy, but he's interested in me? <laughs> huh? What the hell are you pricks looking at? <laughs> <laughs> Go! Run! Oh, that scared the hell out of me. He's even worse in person than on TV. Even worse in person. Well, he doesn't have blurred out TV eyes. Last night was definitely Kanjikun. Yeah, and I just realized something. Remember the common points we were talking about? His mom fits the pattern. She's a woman, and she knew Ms. Yamano. I guess that's... that is... Literally true. Literally true, yeah. Unlikely. It was her son who appeared on TV. But true. So what does that mean? It means that your... Your thing is probably wrong. Uh... All right, all right. So here's how it works. It's... The, the, the woman, it's their... Their eldest child. <laughs> and if they don't have an eldest child, then it's them. That makes the pattern fit. Ah. Uh, irrefutable. Logic. I could, I could understand that. Yeah. <laughs> well, Kanji's a target. That that just seems like the right answer. Yeah. <laughs> seems pretty obvious. Yeah, that's what it seemed like based on the TV image. But his mother fits the pattern more than he does. Maybe your pattern is dumb, Yusuke. Hey, the pattern can be wrong, but we know oh, the people that appear in the TV end up case. in the TV later. True. We know that. True. If you think about it, my mother fit the victim profile more than I did. See, there you go. See, mm. my theory has she the greatest the one proof. Who dealt directly with Miss Yamano, <laughs> but I was. You already know what targeted. the answer is, Jeff. Does that mean it'll be the kid again instead of the mother? But if that's true, then the killer's motive makes no sense at all. It does seem kind of stupid and random. It'd have nothing to do with silencing witnesses or revenge or anything. Maybe they're you just think we're crazy. on the wrong track? No. Maybe even the first case had nothing to do with grudges or revenge. <laughs> Not possible that they have a completely stupid motive, right? Or is there some <laughs> kind of secret in the textile shop? Serial itself? killers kill people for completely arbitrary reasons. Secret in the textile shop. Oh, I'm totally lost. But we can't ignore this. Sure we can. Hmm. Why don't we just go ahead and ask Kanji himself? You were the one who was like, Oh my god, run the fuck away! We could at least see if anything odd's happened lately. He scares the wits out of me, but... Actually, that was Yusuke, wasn't it? <laughs> hey, wasn't yeah. Kanji making plans with that weird kid a moment ago? Weird kid? Look who's talking. Something about meeting up <laughs> at school? I heard he's been skipping school ever since the new year started. Doesn't that seem a little suspicious? No, if I had enough courage, I'd be skipping school all the time. What the fuck's wrong with you? Yeah, something did seem weird. Skip all the school. Yeah, it's suspicious, all right. There's something funny going on here. I can sense it. Mm, she's got intuition or something. Maybe it's something to do with Kung Fu. Probably. Sense? You sound like Teddy. Still, we might find <laughs> no, some clues. Not fair punks to be Teddy. All right. Let's try sticking out that. both Kanji and his family's store. Yeah. We definitely don't want the killer getting ahead of us. That being said... We're getting claws to the killer! Someone? Get it? Because hey, bears have claws? Hey, was this your plan all along? What? 
Uh, no. I got everybody's phone number except for hers. And the Y section of my address book needs some filling out. <laughs> Very I can't. Subtle. I can't use myself. While we're on the subject, could you stop calling me at night just to tell dirty jokes? No. <laughs> you really sound like a pervert. Hey, I'm trying to have a conversation with Yukiko here. Try to get her number so I can send her dirty jokes. Hmm. No. Oh, that reminds me. I need to buy telephone <laughs> on my way home. She's not even paying attention. Well done, Yukiko. Well done. No, she is Ooh, definitely she a word I said. She just doesn't want to be part of that conversation. Okay, then. The stakeout is set for tomorrow. Stakeout. Mm, stakeouts? Tailing people? Woo! I'm getting goosebumps. She's into this shit, man. <laughs> Let's go creepily watch a dude. <laughs> Go watch a dude. Welcome watch home. another dude. Hey, they're gonna talk. But they're both dudes. But he's a dude. And I'm a dude. I'm confused. <laughs> okay. So, uh, uh. I think. Oh, they pretend they're in gangs. What if they really are in gangs? Yeah, I believe it. I mean, Not I mean a he was like. Tell the difference. I mean, all the gangs at school, they ain't in the gangs. They poses. I mean, that guy from TV was like in some kind of serious gang in middle school. Oh, no. Uh, of course. We should of, definitely Of course that. I have to drink it. It's soda. What could be wrong with a soda? A lot of things. Power down the entire bottle in less than a minute. Sweetness of the melon perfectly matches the taste of the cream. And nothing happens. Cause it's fucking soda. <laughs> it's delicious. I don't. Well, that was kind of an oversight. You should have probably bought something. Well, we don't. We don't go shopping. That's not a good job. Yep. Okay. And we didn't even get to do anything that oh, night. Oh, important event things. Well, I'm hiding in the back. I like how we're just like waiting here to ambush someone. No, we're we're taking him out. Yes, this is a very visual ID confirmed. Very <laughs> subtle stakeout. Enzo near the end of his mess break with mother issued rations. No one will ever notice anything. <laughs> mother issued rations in hand. Oh. Current status in the Yosuke bathroom fixing his confirming hair. his status as the <laughs> coolest member of this group. Hi. The target was acting nervous. I left my position before he had a chance to pick on me. <laughs> Thus proving exactly. I wonder what kind of plans they made. It didn't seem like he knew that boy very well. Well, I think there's something more subtle. Yeah, something more subtle, Jay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like when Jay is trying to insinuate oh, something. Mm -hmm. Such smooth skin. Those eyes. Wait, something's wrong here. <laughs> oh no. I didn't keep you waiting, I hope. I like how neither of them notice at all. We're just like standing there staring directly at them. <laughs> 20 feet away. No, I, uh, I just got here too. I'm fixing my hair in the bathroom. Nope. Nope. Picking on nerds. Definitely not stealing Yosuke's lunch money. And his hair gel. <laughs> Clearly doesn't need that. What in the world was that? It looks like they met and went somewhere, Yusuke. How how is that hard to grasp? Because it's Yusuke. Oh, anyways, we've got to hurry after grasp. them or we'll lose them. He, he's usually pretty perceptive about stuff. He's kind of hit and miss. Okay. He does miss. And let's split up into two groups. Sometimes. One team will follow Kanji and the other will stake out the shop. Uh, uh, you get to be, uh, I don't know. I was going to make a Scooby Doo joke. Oh, roger that. How should we split the teams? Uh, I'll go with Yukiko, so Chie can kick you in the nuts. Sound sure, that's fine with me. Oh man, they're almost out of sight! Come on, Yosuke! So I'm pairing up with Chie? 
Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, we'll need uh. to pretend we're on a date to make it look natural. <laughs> <laughs> well done, um, Yosuke. Wait. We, we'd better make out to make it look natural. You might suspect something if we don't make out. Uh, not in a million years. There'll be no need for that if we stay out of sight. We'll sneak instead of doing weird stuff. Oh, Let's hurry up and go. And the shish counter advances. Can't do advances the... towards the midnight. Two, be all right. <laughs> <laughs> two shishes to midnight. We can't do a shish counter. She does it during combat. We can just ignore the out of combat stuff. You mean the combat stuff? <laughs> Look at you, Kiko, just looking back and forth nervously. Um, that leaves us in charge of staking out the textile shop. Should we pretend we're on a date at the textile so... shop? Shall we? <laughs> Shall we what? She doesn't know. She's pretty awkward. Ah, <laughs> oh, but she brought us coffee or something. Sorry about the wait. This one's for you. It's not tofu flavored, is it? I'll throw it down the well. There is a well there. Everything seems fine at the shop. I hope it stays that way. Got a soft drink. Oh, what's really drinking? Probably one of those weird Japanese things. Do you think well, the culprit will come? It's in Japan. I think it stands to reason that it's a Japanese thing. <laughs> well, but it's probably like milk and yak butter juice. Milk and yak butter. <laughs> yak, yak butter juice. Hey. And milk. In Tibet, they drink tea that has yak butter dissolved into it. I meant to say that, but I said okay, milk that, instead of tea. That would make a lot more sense. And they put salt in it because... That's apparently what you do in the Himalayas. <laughs> hey, they need salt. Hey, they need salt. Is there anything I'm supposed to say here? I don't think so. No worries. You'll protect me. Yeah, I'll protect you from the milk. Only because she's a total babe. Oh, okay. Otherwise, Thanks. it'd be Yosuke or something. Oh, no, we're, we're, we're here to save everyone. Even Yosuke. Really? Yeah, we have to. Well, okay. The babes will like us we more if we, save, if we save Yosuke. That is an excellent point. It would be scary if the culprit did show up. Or Kanji. Well, she's not afraid of Kanji. I remember now. <laughs> she she knows he's not intimidating. But if they do, I'll do what I can to help you catch them. Like, throw shoes at him. You all saved my life. I don't want to be the only one doing nothing. Don't worry. Teddy's there, too. Doing nothing. <laughs> can you smell can you, monsters? I'm sure there's something I can do. Hey, Teddy can smell oh, all kinds of things. Sorry. I went on and on without realizing. I... I guess I'm a little nervous. We already know she has a persona. Yeah, she's got magical powers. Too. I've never chatted with a boy my age like this before. Ever. What about Yusuke? You talk to Yusuke. <laughs> Yusuke's not a boy. Don't don't be ridiculous. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Chie, of course, has no problem getting along with guys because of her personality. Is she's that... pretty cool. She does. I mean, she talks about kung fu and stuff. And if they don't get along we with talk her, she'll just kung fu and stuff. We do. That's a thing people talk about. I know. I'm, I'm just yeah. saying that she is, is is easier to relate to for a guy, I guess. But I think she's had more fun hanging out with you and Yosuke lately. We are pretty fun. Yeah, you've been Especially stuck in me. the TV world for a month, Yukiko. <laughs> or something. <laughs> the same is true for me. Oh. Ah, yeah, this is a... Uh, Automatic social link for her. Done. I'm very glad that Yusuke wasn't blushing all the time in our initial social link with him. How do you know he wasn't? Because it didn't show up on his portrait. He, I mean, he could be better I'm at hiding. Convinced. He's better at hiding. There we go. Establish the Yukiko Mami Priestess. Arc. Yeah, she's a she's a support character. She's a healer. Uh, you she's can also. Tell she's a priestess because she has bangs. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Yeah, I understand these things. Uh, but she's also really strong as far as uh, yeah, she could take a mortal blow. Um, like a dugu. And uh, the. Uh, you haven't asked you to go for her contact. Now. Of course. Ask her straight out. Hey, baby. I need your digits. <laughs> we can do this! You want. Because Yukiko is not scary like Chie. <laughs> I can't always answer since I help out around the inn. But feel free to call any time. Oh, yeah. Well, that went well. Yeah, it was like, 
That literally is the implication there, is that Chie is too scary to to ask her about things like that. Sounds about right. I've talked about many things, like this fucking yak about her or whatever. <laughs> what the hell is this See, we, shit? We need to... They didn't even notice her. See, even now she's training her kung fu. What? Uh, not that kind of date, guys. <laughs> this is weird. That's not a pro... Yes, it is. <laughs> there you go. Screenshot. Yeah, we definitely stand out. Or kneel out. <laughs> yeah, we definitely... Come no, on, that was I intentional. Them. I them. I get this weird feeling about them. Um, what are you trying to imply here, Chie? Weird? What about them's weird? I hang out with dudes all the time. And I talk oh, about how hairy they are. How to put it? It's normal stuff. Yeah. Oh, well, maybe it's just my imagination. <laughs> Hey, how do you think the others yeah, are doing? Just like, huh? Probably throwing drinks what in the does well. What she mean? Beats me. For all we know, he's hitting on Yukiko as we speak. That, that is, is actually <laughs> exactly what's happening. <laughs> yep. Yeah, that is what we were doing. <laughs> yeah, no. He's not like you. This is why she's too scary for us to ask. Yukiko doesn't seem to be interested in that stuff anyway. Uh, okay. Wait. Are you saying he's interested in her? We said we were interested in everyone. Well, all the girls. The ladies. The ladies. Huh? I, I, I wouldn't know. It's not like I've asked we him directly. We don't really talk about that kind of stuff. <laughs> 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 well, let's change the subject. But what about those guys? They're weird, right? <laughs> now I'm even more suspicious. You know something, don't you? Why do you care anyway? Cause, cause it's surprising that I know she she was too. It's not like we've been hanging out for that jealous. long. I guess, maybe. The hell are oh you shit! Two doing? <laughs> <laughs> Perfect comedic timing. Just, just so you know, that choice at the beginning wasn't really a choice. That's always the division you're given there, because you have to do that per Yukiko social link. Mm -hmm. Oh well. You see, we're, we're just two, just two crazy lovebirds. <laughs> I like the the uh, crisis music that's playing here. Listen. Well played, Yosuke. Now she can't say no. It's like he's about to bust a chair over their head or something. <laughs> uh, what do you mean, bird? Birds? So that, that's the part she objects to. Leave alone, bird brain. Didn't I see you guys yesterday? They moonwalk backwards. <laughs> Come on. It just so happened that we were walking behind you guys. Pure coincidence. Not kneeling behind a tree. Hey, our houses are just over that way, so we'll be going now. Um, look, we weren't planning on getting in your guys' way, and, and there's nothing strange about it either. <laughs> Chie, what are you trying to say? S strange. Strange? You're applying something? Why can't you keep your big mouth shut? Whoa, 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 wait. Damn it! <laughs> what are you trying to just No! No! Go back! <laughs> you gotta know, right? This This is why this game is much better than Persona 3. No one is no one has ever been chased around a gazebo. <laughs> At this point in Persona 3, you would be like talking about Nietzsche or something. <laughs> no, no. Mr. Moroka talks about that stuff. Okay, that's true, that's fair. But then he calls us perverts and assholes afterwards. Hey! Are you listening, damn it? Let's just watch him go around for a minute. <laughs> we are oh, definitely seriously, listening. Ain't like that. Push down Yusuke. He'll be he'll be <laughs> he'll be fine. I love how he thinks. Like they, they they think he's he's chasing them because he thinks they're following him, and that's not the case at all. We regret to inform that our mission failed. <laughs> There was nowhere to hide. Classic <laughs> Japanese businessmen regret pose. It will take a full oh. responsibility. Let's wait here a little longer. Maybe Kanji kun will come home. <laughs> and then he can chase all yeah. of us. He won't chase me. I'll fight him. I'll fight you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, whoa! What are you guys doing here? Uh, I didn't say anything about fighting you, Kanji. You're those stupid lovebirds I just saw. <laughs> and Yusuke! 
We are not a couple. Why are you assholes following me around? Hey, we were here first. What the hell's going on? I ain't saying this is you guys' fault. He's just a confused young man. But damn it! Hey, uh, mind if we ask something? Has anything strange happened to you lately? <laughs> hmm. Other than us? Huh? Strange? strange. It's not strange. It's the strange stuff, huh? Are you saying that I'm strange? <laughs> I think he's got a little bit of a trigger here. <laughs> huh? No, 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 I, I didn't mean... It's not the, quite the word I was looking for. The, the, the disconnect, the, the complete misunderstanding here is one of my favorite down. parts of the game. I love Kanji's voice actor. <laughs> yeah. What? Wait, why? I look like I'm choking! <laughs> um. Oh shit! <laughs> it's gonna fuck us up! As fast as our legs would carry us. <sighs> Too much running. She, who probably does the most running. Imagine how tired we must be. Well, nothing happened today, so I guess everything's okay. But it's already been a few days since he appeared on the Midnight Channel. If this is anything like Yukiko's case, it'll happen soon. Maybe he's just harder to throw into the TV because he's a big, tall dude. Then we can't let our guard down. I think we should come back tomorrow to check up on him. Looks like we've got no choice. We have to keep riling up this dangerous motorcycle gang beating up guy. Let's go home. I'm wiped. Yeah. That's like 50 on the sheesh counter. So many sheeshes. Approaching critical sheesh. <laughs> I didn't get wet. I was hiding under um, the gazebo. Alright. So she doesn't have her, her thing over her head, so she doesn't have a social link available Indeed. today. Neither do the bears. Neither do the bears. They gotta, gotta check the fridge. Okay, spoiler: they don't have a social link. They're bears who live on top I'm of the sorry, TV. Sorry, I know we just ruined the game for you. I don't think I have to study. The bears are in fact not a social link for a while, really. But uh, I'll check the fridge anyway. Nothing. Oh. I mean, I might as well study or do something anyway. Let's try to save the game, though. Yeah, probably. Shall we?